We're going to do a little exercise for you guys to be able to understand how when you have the single leg, and I'll show you the difference between single leg X and X star here. So look, what I do is, okay, you grab it here, so it takes a slack out, and you twist and you pull. Okay. Or you can just grab it right here. Okay. You just pull them right here. Okay. So as I rock and push him away here, look, I'm going to stretch this, and I'm going to pull him in right here. Okay, and I'm making flow. This hand right here immediately hooks right here. Okay. My objective is literally to get him off balance. Okay. How do I get him off balance? I begin to rock him. Push, pull, rotate. Okay. This is single leg X. If I can begin to pull him this way here, let's say I do this, this, and this right here. See how his right foot's off the mat? I can underhook this right here, okay? Put it up on my shoulder, keep them away. See how I'm up on my elbow? Lock your hands to the right and let it work. See what I'm doing right here? Okay, I'm gonna put my left foot on his thigh and I'm gonna give him a little bit of a push as I come up on my knee. He's probably gonna roll this back. As I have this leg here, and I'm just gonna go forward and under. Okay, or we'll do, does that make sense? So that's going from daily Eva, single leg X, to X. Okay. Now, what I just want you guys to do is, is this, go give me your sleep. Okay. I want to make it back up. So pushing the hip, it's not as effective as kind of pushing the thigh. But just be careful, you don't want to like push right into the knee because it buckles. So I want to pull him and then push him. Yes. Okay. So as I go here, look, I'm pulling him into my right foot, okay? I'm gonna enter the single leg X here, right here. Hook, one, two. See how he's floating? He stands up, okay? For whatever reason, you miss this left foot, okay? okay. I like to kind of do this right here. He pushes that knee through, and he steps. Okay. Mm. And right back. But in, in real, like this. Because if he tries to step backwards, yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay. See so yeah, he's stuck, and I'm underneath. It's a horrible place to be, because you can't quite get off that. Because by the time he begins to untangle this right here, especially if they don't know how to pass a single leg X, you're gonna sweep him, okay, right in on that, okay? So I remove this, he pushes that knee through, so frame here, hip, Knee. He pushes that knee through. Okay. Now, he pushes the knee through. Look, I frame as I hit. I need to be able to rotate in. Okay. Look. Okay. And notice how my head's off the mat. If you're like this, it's not going to work, okay? You have to be head off the mat so that you can begin to, at minimum, get this through here, make space, and then hook that through here, okay? One more time, he pushes the knee through, I frame it, and come back in, okay? My left foot aims for his ball hit, okay? <coughs> My right foot hooks. This is the X. This is the single leg because I have a single leg. Okay? And I can begin to rock here. One, two, three, here. And we're not even talking about this, too. Because I can go here, here, and then go here. Okay? And then this right here turns really horrible, also. Okay? And you have to look up all. But we're not going to do that. We need some help. Just a drill. It was just a drill. Look, watch this. Uh, come on down. Check this out. Just to give you a little variety. Look, I go in this slider. I go here. He stands up. Look. Right here. From the spider look. When 
they stand up, spider guard is very easy kind of to remove. But you put your foot on the mat like Hamlo Bahal does, and you go, whoop, and you make him step here. As this goes one, two, three, and now you have him. Now, he busters up. You put this left foot on the mat, he pushes the knee through, frame, hip, rotate. Come on that, frame, frame, hip, rotate. Put on the mat. Frame. Hip. Rotate. You have to have a cooperative partner drill. Okay? Because if your partner is going to be too lazy or too wobbly, you have to be able to do it. Okay? Because the person that's on top, they really don't want to fall. Okay? Your objective is to make them fall. You can't do it with this, this right here. This has to be engaged, engaged, engaged. You have to be lined up. Okay? Like your spine. Lined up with this foot right here, okay? Put on the mat, hip, foot here, stay, okay? One more time, okay? Get the knee in, right in, okay? And then push him away here, okay? Make sense, guys? Let's do it, one, two, three. All of this is gonna make it easier for you guys to actually set up the sweeps and to bear the weight. <laughs> 